Hey guys, Shaber1000 here. Today, we're going to find out why this thing does not run. Stick with me. Okay guys, today we're going to check this uh, golf cart out and find out it's electric. It's all battery powered, but if you can see right here on the dashboard, let's turn it on. It's reading its almost three fourths charge. Horn works. Turn signals work. But nothing. Nothing. So let's check it out and see what's going on with it. What we gotta do here, we gotta lift this seat up. Alright, we got the seat lifted up. Here's the batteries. Now I'm seeing some some green stuff there. I'm seeing a lot here and I'm guessing this yeah there it is. Right there's the problem. I'll bet you anything. So what we're going to have to do yeah see all that? That's not good. Alright, first thing we're going to do, I'm going to go get some coke, and I'm going to clean that off. Okay guys, I'm going to try to do this one-handed. got that coke here. It's not mine, it's her mom's. Well, she bought it for me last time I was here because she thought I, I like diet coke, but that's okay. I'm going to pour a little bit of this on here see that bubbling up now pour a little bit on here then I'll get some water and rinse that off and we'll see if we can't find an end in the garage to Put onto that cable and see if that's the issue. All right, we're back. First thing we want to do is we want to cut this end off. All right, so I got a couple sets of cutters here. I don't know if either one of them will cut up, but we'll see. Doesn't look like it. Okay, let's try the other pair. Alright, let me go get another pair of cutters. There we go. That should work. I couldn't find a regular end. So what we're going to do is we're going to use this end here. We're going to bolt that on there and this on to here and we'll see see what we get from there. This is all this is at her mom and dad's so I'm using her dad's tools. I hate using another guy's tools, but 
I mean, he's got everything here, so I didn't bring a lot with me. this up Now we gotta go get a hospital bed for when her dad gets back. So we gotta go get that. Her mom had to go get a stress test done, so that's where she took her. So I figured now would be a good time as any to find out what was wrong with her golf cart. Because if it don't run, you can't sell it, right? I know you can't see much, but you get the idea of what's going on here, right? So I'm guessing since this one wire is still connected here, that's probably why it still had the horn and everything still working on it. So, let's go ahead and loosen this up. Take that off. There's the old piece that broke. Set that up there. I'm gonna go ahead and set this on first. And I'm gonna set this down on here. Put a washer on it. Tighten her up and we'll see what we got. Turn that around that way so it doesn't touch any metal. Alright. Now, let's move this stuff out of the way. Let's see what we got. I brought my, my tester. I got this thing with uh, temperature probes and a couple extra leads and then a bag. I got this for like $3 at a yard sale. So, well, it came in a box of stuff, but. All right, let's try this. All right, we're on. We got power. I heard a click. Put it in reverse. Nope, still nothing. Put it forward. Still nothing. So, let's check the batteries. I mean, it's got enough juice it should at least move. Uh, headlights are working. So let's, uh, let's check see if there's any fuses bad. Okay guys, we're on the other side. I was wiggling the wires, the cables around to see if I found any loose cables and lo and behold there's one right here so let's see if he's got another end like that in the garage somewhere like we put on the other side let's put it on here and see because see that's not going to make a full connection see they're running series so Let's see what we can find out. Okay guys, so this is what I came up with for now to check it. 
and if that's the problem then I'll go ahead and get them another length of cable the right cable for that and the right end for that one over there so let's see what happens And there we go. So, all right. Okay, looks like we're good to go. All right guys, I'm gonna put this on the charger so that way it'll be charging up good and I think we got it. All we gotta do is get the, the right ends for it but now we know what the problem is. It's nothing major so I checked the batteries and uh, they're all good. Uh, they're a little low so we're good to go there guys. So they should be getting back and then we gotta go get that bed. Stay tuned. Okay guys. So we got the golf cart figured out. I just gotta get the regular ends that go on it and put them on there for her, and that'll be that'll be good to go. So we got the bed loaded. That's one of them kinda like a hospital bed goes up and down all that stuff for her dad but we had help when we loaded it but we got to deal with this thing we got to set the ramp down set the tailgate down and there's only two of us just me and monkey now I'm telling you what me and another guy monkey and then this other woman helped load it so we gotta unload it. Take it over through that door there. And put it in the house. So, that's what we gotta do. Here we go. I'm not supposed to lift over five pounds, right? Yeah, you're doing it for your father-in-law. Now listen, if this thing starts to go, or let it go. It's going up there. I don't care, let it go. We got welders and shit, I can fix this. I can't fix a broken bone. Now what we gotta do, that's enough time. So let's get up here. What do I do with my foot? <laughs> Listen, we got lifted up here. We're down with it. Wait a minute. <laughs> if it starts gonna... to go, just let it well, go. Well, you got a golf cart then, and you know. I don't care about the golf cart. I don't want to hit nobody and be liable. Ready to come off the tailgate, huh? So, 
One of us has got to be down there, one of us has got to be up here. What do you want me to do? You want me to stay up here and you go down there? Okay, you got this? Yeah, I got it. I just, I'm going to drag it down off there and just let it roll right down and slide off that puck, okay? Alright, watch the truck. Ready? Push it down. Hang on. Ah! <laughs> Relax. Alright. Come on down. <laughs> Jump down. No. <laughs> come on, baby. Yay, baby. No! Ah! <laughs> Alright. That's what we're going to do. It's heavy in. We gotta pick it up, let it slide, so we can set it down. And then we'll regroup. Ready? Can I hold that? No. Oh my god. Oh. I did it. Yay! Thank you, babe. Hey guys, that's it for now. I took the basket out. It just slides into the receiver. Just goes right inside there in a pin. Hooks it up. So now we're gonna get this thing inside and I'm gonna call it a day, alright? Yeah. Okay. okay. Alright guys. Maybe you need to rest for a Shaper 1000, I'm gone for now. We'll see you soon. Bye. Bye.